Hi, this is Shivaranjani. I'm one of the co-founders of Kanavu. Uh, Kanavu means dreams in Tamil and uh, we work on rural education and community development in uh, one of the coasts of uh, Tamil Nadu called Kadalur. So, uh, why did I join this program? Uh, I think I'm an engineer turned entrepreneur and it, it was almost an accident. I was not planning to start up an organization and be a founder of that. So five years into working with these communities and in this sector, uh, I realized that I need an overall picture of where the organization fits in in the entire social sector ecosystem. And I was really curious to understand what kind of strategic direction should our organization take. And given I'm in a position where I can make these decisions for my organization, uh, I felt like I need to know where the sector has been uh, for the past uh, years and where should it go in the future. And so this brought me to a formal learning and thanks to APU that, uh, you know, this course is for, meant for working professionals. And my biggest buy-in was the fact that I didn't have to leave uh, work or take a sabbatical to do this course, but I could, I could do this uh, while working. So all of that uh, brought me to this course. What I loved about this is that I met at least one professional from every state of the country. Uh, so I have worked only in Tamil Nadu uh, and in a deep manner and meeting professionals from different states gave me an idea of what, what, is, what is India like and uh, what are these programs in different parts of the country uh, you know, functioning as and speaking to these leaders gave me a lot of insight on uh, where is the sector heading. So uh, that's one thing that, is, that I would say is unique about this program. And uh, one more thing about the course is that uh, none of these subjects that are curated are theoretical entirely in nature because they're always kept in mind that these are professionals who are taking the course and the learnings to apply it in their work. Uh, so the other thing that I loved about work is the, uh, about the courses is that uh, there, is, there are segments in the course that help you pause and take learnings to work and you know give it a shape so that you can apply it uh, in your work right away. So with respect to learnings from this course, I think I'm looking at it in two broad categories. One is the concrete ones that I'm taking away, which, can, which I can implement in my organization, uh, like uh, financial management, for instance, compliances, and what, what should we look at when we have to be a healthy organization. Uh, in fact, I uh, sort of designed and implemented a survey which we needed for needs analysis for one of our programs during the course itself. So, uh, so that all of that becomes like a concrete learning and how do I apply that into my organization. Uh, the second I see is that uh, there's a lot of potential in staying in touch with these leaders uh, and adding them to my network, uh, including the professors who I see as mentors uh, going forward in the areas that our organization needs support in. So uh, both concrete as well as learnings that I see that can be ongoing because we sort of became a close-knit community as we came here in person for the course. Uh, so I'm really eager and excited to apply these learnings uh, going forward. My favorite moments from class uh, are those moments where uh, there are certain underlying tensions, right, as us as leaders, uh, that, that comes out. Uh, for instance, in term one, we had uh, some very tense conversations uh, on religious diversities and the current state of the nation. So when that's brought out in a, in a live classroom and we have, you know, spontaneous discussions on that, I think I found that very alive. And uh, the, the kind of atmosphere that's set up by the professors uh, to be able to have those conversations, I think, was really important. Uh, similarly, we had uh, conversations around around uh, uh, other diversities and our tolerances towards that. So all of those uh, those nature of conversations are something that I'm taking back uh, because the course mostly focuses around, um, uh, you know, content based um, uh, learnings, but uh, who are us as leaders given we are in decision making positions and we bring in uh, certain expertise and opinions ourselves. I think it, this space gave us a great opportunity uh, to put out our opinions, to understand who we are, uh, to, uh, to bring a gender lens to our discussions, uh, to bring a, a religion, a caste based uh, lens to our discussions. I think those are some moments that I'm going to take back from the course very dearly.